Road users in Hulu Selangor and Salayan will have their travel time reduced during peak hours from Rawang and Surinda to Kuala Lumpur from 2 hours to just 30 minutes with the newly opened Rawang Bypass. The toll-free highway which features a 2.7 km elevated stretch is unique by itself as it is the tallest highway in the country involving pillar structures at the height of 58.2 meters. The construction of the Rawang Bypass took 12 years to complete at a cost of 628 million ringgit. Untuk membina Rawang Bypass ini banyak cabaran yang terpaksa kita lalui bukan saja dari segi sudut teknikal iaitu engineering tapi pada masa yang sama kita ditetapkan dengan kriteria begitu ketat disebabkan ianya melibatkan hutan simpan yang mana ada spesies tertentu yang mesti dipelihara dan dipulihara. This elevated construction marvel offers a panoramic view of the hilly and densely forested Kanching Eco Forest Park and Lagong Forest Reserve, both part of Taman Warisan Selangor. These forests harbour beautiful waterfalls, rivers and catchment areas, exotic wildlife as well as unique flora and fauna, including the celebrated Giam Kanching, a plant unique to only this part of the world. Kita kena redesign balik uh, keseluruhan uh, jalan ini dari segi bukan saja desainnya tapi juga method pelaksanaan projek ini juga uh, menggunakan teknologi yang pertama sekali digunakan di Malaysia. Making environmental sustainability its main agenda, the authorities decided to adopt the viaduct solution instead of the conventional cut and fill method to cut through this stretch of environmentally sensitive area. The viaduct solution offers very minimal and localized cutting of slopes, leading to minimal disturbance of the vegetation and ecosystem. The Rawang Bypass was also the first construction project in Malaysia to use the innovative MSS, Movable Scaffolding System Technology, which contributed substantially towards preserving the surrounding ecosystem. The MSS prevented the use of excessive heavy machinery during construction. Being self-launching, it does not require any supporting cranes for handling support brackets, resulting in minimal impact on the forest reserve along its alignment. Kita menggunakan uh, jentera dipanggil sebagai MSS, iaitu Mobile Scaffolding System, uh, di mana uh, jentera tersebut tidak terletak di paras bumi, ianya tergantung di bawah rasuk jambatan dan kita cuma sambung menyambung saja scaffolding tersebut dan secara tak langsung ini akan uh, tidak menjejaskan alam sekitar. The project was delayed from its original targeted finish time of 2008. This was largely due to using the hand-dug caisson method for the construction of the foundation, which avoided the need for mobilization and usage of heavy bore piling machinery. Apart from enhancing much smoother traffic flow from Bagarawa, this bypass is also expected to boost developments in neighboring towns in Surinda, Batangkali and Tanjung Malim. The Rawang Bypass stands as a model example of how innovative construction technology can contribute towards not just cost-cutting and greater productivity, but also towards environmental sustainability.